Please, I need your help. I don't have much time. Erase me. They want to erase who I am. <gasps> They're coming. Who defaced the pages of this manifesto? This is a disaster. This is poison. Who fed you this poison? It was the librarian, wasn't it? How did nobody see these being distributed? Cooper, get us some water. Sovereign water from the commissary. Go! Where is it? Not the defaced manifesto. Where is it? Tell me, or I'll tell them. But you are them. <gasps> I don't... I don't know what you're talking about. Child, where is it? Where's what? <sighs> I did... Call for please rock. Our computer scrubbed the word poison. I have to check it out. It's not like that, Derringer. I can handle this precal myself. Look, I need to know if someone's poisoning the food and water supply in this place. I am talking about this, you idiot. Poison for the mind. It's just a manifesto. Not just. It's been contaminated. These are the words of Zager. Zager is dead. But I guess we could dig him up and shoot him again. Anything else, Murray? What? That's not enough? The girl's infected. Found reading contraband. Third offense. We are taking I her I didn't to read anything! I child, Dillinger. You would put her in a confinement cell. They there will be no recalibration without my authority. Fine. Just do it before the arrival. And watch your step. Watch your step. You ever shut up? Bring her a blanket. I don't want her freezing to death before tomorrow.
Good evening, citizens of Metamorphosis. As we make our final preparations, we must be extra vigilant. Recent events have brought us the capture and killing of a man whose sinister, disgusting actions caused no small amount of grief. You know who I am referring to. I will not speak his name again. But even though he has been eliminated, other threats remain. Just tonight, another treasonist was attempting to invent the minds of our youngest and brightest with lies, masquerading as divine text. This Mimeo apostate will be dealt with in the same manner as the one who inspired him. Keep a watchful eye out for our Republic, my friends. And in return, she will watch over you. What's the difference? There's no way you can help me from there. You're just another pair of eyes watching me. Did you do that? door? I don't know who you are or how you're doing this, but somehow you found a way into this place. Can you help me find a way out? Hello. Please do not be alarmed by the sound of my voice. My name's Cooper. I am communicating with you in text-to-speech because it is too risky for me to use my real voice. I am the one who found the phone in the girl's room just a moment ago. I've returned the phone to her because she is in danger and I wish to help her. It seems you wish to help her too. I do not presume that you are as technically inclined as I am. So I will skip the occupational lingo and get directly to the point. The phone she's carrying is a link, giving you access to our facility's online network. It is called, OmniView. By entering OmniView, you can easily move from one camera to another. To keep the girl out of sight, you'll need to scout ahead for her. The rest I'll explain as you go. Good luck. I'm sure you can. Hack it in this place. That was a joke by the way. Sometimes my humor gets lost in translation.
Sanchez. Yes, madame. Don't forget to give her the sodium thiopental injection. Yes, madame. And he sees me. Get your hands off me. <clears throat> Captive is in confinement. The girl must feel a strong sense of deja vu, but fortunately you have been down this road before too. Each confinement room contains a power unit in case of power failure. Find the unit to open the door. 
It is in a different location inside every room, so check every corner in Omni View. This is a battery charging station. Certain Omni abilities will drain the battery on the girl's phone. You'll see her battery life displayed in the upper right hand corner of your screen. Direct the girl to any recharging station to juice up. battery was getting low. Despite being obnoxious, this poster makes a valid point. 
The girl is less likely to attract attention if she walks softly. Recently, the children in Metamorphosis have become more brazen in their attempts to take things from the Prizrak. Surely, this was Zager's influence. The paranoia is warranted in this case. A Precal once found the key to the armory and stole a dozen tasers. It took seven Prizrak to finally bring him down. Firefight with Prizrak. The depravity of this man was boundless. Best to remove the comments section for the online edition. And change shot dead by Prizrak to killed in firefight by Prizrak. This way it suggests he was given a sporting chance. When the surveillance video of this day surfaces, and it will, it's going to require major surgery if they want it to look like justice. The Prizrak waged their campaign against Zager from this very room. The following conversation was recorded two months ago. Listen, Prizrak, calling the man a menace doesn't give him the credit he deserves. Put another team on scrubbing through the footage. I will, sir. Though so far the camera network hasn't been terribly effective. Zager's a human being, not some phantom. He casts a shadow like the rest of us. And I'm giving you more than you should need to find him now. Should that prove too difficult for you? No, sir. I understand. Watch your step. You've found one of the developer commentary markers. There are 100 markers like...
can get to the library. I can find the librarian. He can protect me. Sleep when you're dead. Come on. Derringer wants us to lock up the atrium. I had a dream I won the lottery. Yeah? What was the jackpot? Ten thousand. You gotta dream bigger than that. I you wanna buy your way out of here. a sound. Dear Mr. Derringer, after mentioning this to you in passing, I wanted to send you this letter reminding you of my sincere desire for advancement. I believe I have a lot to offer, and in my current position, I will not be able to demonstrate my true potential. Plus, it's boring. Whenever you have time, I would love the opportunity to discuss my moving to the day shift at greater length. Sincerely, yada yada yada. How's that? Can you hack the door? Why can't you open it? Hello. It is Cooper again. You need to upgrade your software at a demon server to open this door. Then the girl can enter the library. The nearest demon is in the commissary on the other side of the dorms. The dorm is a big place, so I have updated your map with this waypoint to the server in the commissary. Proceed with caution. It seems like you have a plan. What do we need to do? sign of the girl. Nine zero H, my dear, my inspiring pupil. I know you're not accustomed to gifts, but this is more than just some trinket. It is a secret between you and I, and it cannot be shared until we are both ready. So I will keep the key for safekeeping until the two of us agree to open it together. 
Until then, I hope you will treasure its beauty as much as I do you. And when you gaze upon it, I hope your thoughts will be of me. Hey, fishy. You hungry? Here you go. What does the world look like to you? Fishy, I'll tell you a secret. I like a boy who lives on the other hall. The one we call Weep. He sits beside me in history class and he's adorable. I'm too shy to talk to him. Pyramid flags flutter in the wind. His voice carries above them, singing a promise to lead these men to honor, protect, and love them. From his garden perch, he keeps us secure against the forces of evil. He spares our minds the hollow allure and fraud of Zager's upheaval. The Republic stands and will for all time safe from ruin or disaster, because he is watching out for us all, our noble and wise headmaster. This is the girl's room. 390H. Of course, this isn't what she calls herself. You picked a good place. This spot looks good. See me here. Thanks. You found me a good spot. Nothing.
The lustful poet's vulgar whims blow down the walls of our house, exploding beauty into decadence. The civil engineer takes what is true, regardless of source, and puts it to use for safety and comfort. The monopolist unifies different industries under the banner of righteous service to promote the common good. The slothful union man spends more time relaxing beneath the Wisely, the politician shows that serving the people is the path of the same earthly duty. The neighborly policeman gives the children time to settle down, maintaining law and order with rare care. The overseer secures the bonds between us all. Only let him serve, and you will be served in return. Before we can look to the future, we must look to the one who will lead us there. The glutton baby kisser stuffs herself with ballots until she is purged from office and once more desperate to please. The state artist seeks only to educate her neighbors against the ordinary, exposing the working class field. Wisely, the politician shows that serving the people is the path of serving earthly duty. Okay, let's get out of here before she shows up.
One of the great terrors of literature is its ability to touch a reader's unspoken experience. But you understand, librarian, a republic requires peace between its citizens. Animal Farm gives voice to bigoted trends we must erase. Its laws separate citizens into different body types, those with two legs and four legs and wings. It's a short jump from this fiction to realizing that you've never lost. This one belongs in a cage. Nicely done. You are one cool customer. Now you have the Omni software update needed to access the library door. I have set a new waypoint to lead you back to the atrium. Before going back to the atrium, I recommend unlocking a few Omni abilities at this terminal. Fake passports and foreign currency. The overseer has an escape plan, even if the rest of us do not. Mr. Trangle is off. Vice Admiral Matthews of the Pacific Fleet. Pacific? You're a long way from home, Admiral. So are you, if I'm to believe the rumors. First time in Washington, sir? Hardly. I was told General Karnofsky was heading up this project. The general retired over the holidays. I'm overseeing now, from a military standpoint at least. I see. Apologies if I seem hurried. I have a meeting with the new superintendent of the Naval Academy at one. That's in five minutes. Like I said. Well, it's hardly enough time to pitch my vision. I've, um, so I've read over your evaluative study and we've taken your recommendations into account. Is this a joke to you? Your security, the security of your country, is at stake. Now you listen here. I dedicate my life to the protection and security of the United States. If you think you have a better approach, we'll entertain it. But do not come in here and make threats. I made no such thing. And try to muscle some wildly expensive cryptographic software through the door. You can pay today to prevent a catastrophe. Or you'll pay tomorrow. That's a threat. Right there. You get out of my office. Now! Hey, it's... Hey, Dolores. Yes, lock the door behind him. I don't want to see Mr. Treglas off anywhere near this building again. You understand? What the hell? No, I'm here. No, he, he left, uh, something on my desk. I don't think we need the bomb squad. It's a, a pin. It's just a, like a lapel pin. Censorship AI to be updated, expanded. Profanity. An assault on young and old alike. Now that f has gone too far. You can have my right to privacy. You can have my booze and caffeine and chocolate. But when you take away my right to curse a blue streak, you leave me with nothing to say. For once in my f job, I am absolutely f speechless.
You just found a data broker terminal. These are located throughout the facility. Any data you collect by scanning items in OmniView can be traded to the data broker in exchange for new Omni abilities. Omni abilities are valuable tools for gathering information and assuming control of the girl's environment. What are you buying? Great email exchanges. I need a screwdriver to open this vent. I need a screwdriver to open this vent. A screwdriver. These are great for opening vents, but they are flimsy and will often break. Hopefully, there's more than one lying around. Screwdriver. Heading to the vent. There goes another good screwdriver. Last month, a pre kale got their hands on a canister of pepper spray. They blinded a loyalist Prizrak during routine inspection.
Over there. I'll find you. Find you. I hope they can't see me here. Huh? What's that? Hmm. I'm pursuing the subject. Apprehended the girl. Captive secure. <laughs> 